Hello, this video is to help you locate and understand your chat state schedule. First, log into TigerWeb. Feel free to press pause while you get logged in. Okay, so once you're logged in, we're going to scroll down. You're going to hit click on the green circle that says self-service banner. And then we're going to hit the yellow-orange rectangle. Then we're going to click student. Then we're going to click registration. Then we're going to click week at a glance. All right, so here's the schedule. That easy to find. Uh, please note that classes uh, will begin on August 24, 2020, so make sure it says that you're looking at the week of August 24, 2020. If not, you can put the date in over here and click Submit to make sure you're looking at the right schedule. So as we um, evaluate my schedule, we'll see here that on Monday um, I have Math 1030 and that it is virtual. So that means I am going to log in via Zoom, Teams, WebEx, whatever video conferencing platform that the professor or instructor prefers, and that's going to be between 12 and 12.50 p.m. So that class is virtual. Click on the next videos after this to find out exactly how you log in and the information on where the virtual class will be. Uh, so check those out. So here on Tuesday, it says I have an in-person on a schedule class. So that's going to be from 11 to 1215. So that means I'm actually going to go to class um, to the building MTC at um, room number 115 between that time. I know some of you may have wanted more in-person on a schedule classes um, due to the circumstances. Very few were offered. This is really are mostly offered for on, uh, you know, hands-on classes. Like this is TV production. So I notice here that this class is over at 12:15. This class begins at 12:30. That's not going to give me time. Although this is virtual, it's just not going to give me time to get home to be able to, you know, log into the Zoom or Teams or WebEx. So what am I going to do? I am going to go to our library. It's located in the IMC building. I'm going to utilize their computers so that I can attend the class virtually there. I may also ask this professor here if there's any way I could stay in this room and use my laptop or if it is a lab. I'm just going to check and see what my options are. As we continue looking at the schedule, we see that, again, the math is Monday, Wednesday, Friday virtual. I have college success that's virtual. And then we already talked about this in-person class. But I thought I had four classes. That's only three. So I know where's English. So if you don't see your classes, make sure you scroll up because sometimes they're hidden down here. So here's my Comp 1 class. And it is, of course, without assigned meeting time. So that's online anytime. So that means you are going to do the work on your own. You don't have to log in and be on a video conference. It is online anytime. So you will need to make sure you meet the deadlines for discussions, quizzes, tests, turning papers in. So you'll have to make the deadlines and make sure you meet those. So while we're here on this, you may want to take a picture of your schedule so that you know exactly what time that you need to um, log on to be part of the classes virtually or in person as well. So that's your schedule. Um, good luck to you. And if you need anything, make sure you reach out. Have a great day. Oh, one more thing. If you do want to, there's right down here, there's more of a detailed schedule. If you want to read and see all your classes, like if you have some online ones, you could read and see more details on this detailed schedule. All right, that's it. Have a great day and good luck. You can do it. Bye-bye.